Hello friends, today's fun story is called Super Worm, written by Julia Donaldson and Axel Scheffler. Super Worm by Julia Donaldson and Axel Scheffler. Super Worm, there he is between the trees. Super Worm is super long. Super worm is super strong. Watch him wiggle, see him squirm. Hip hip hooray for super worm. Help, disaster, baby toad has hopped onto a major road. Someone help him, quick, quick. Oh no, the toad is in the middle of the road. Look, a super worm lasso. He pulled the toad back. The bees are feeling bored today. They need a nice new game to play. Cheer up, bees. No need to mope. It's Super Worm, the skipping rope. That's funny. Beetle's fallen in the well. Is she drowning? Who can tell? Not to panic. All is fine. It's Super Worm, the fishing line. Oh, goes down and reaches for the beetle. Then toads and beetles, bees and bugs, brother snails and sister slugs, Uncle Earwig, Auntie Ant, clap and cheer and chant this chant. <gasps> super Worm is super long. Super Worm is super strong. Watch him wiggle, see him squirm. Hip, hip, hooray for Super Worm. The chant is carried on the air to Wizard Lizard in his lair. He mutters in his servant's ear, find that worm and bring him here. <gasps> the servant crow is black and grim. Everyone's scared of him. They all let out a fearful shriek to see their hero in his beak. Uh-oh, Super Worm has been caught. The wizard waves his magic flower. Now, Super Worm, you're in my power, and you must tunnel, writhe, and coil to find me treasure in the soil. Super Worm is very cross, to have a lizard as his boss, but when he tries to slink away, the wizard's magic makes him stay. For days he tunnels, twists, and winds, but all the treasure that he finds is two small buttons, half a cork, a toffee, and a plastic fork. The lizard flicks an angry tail. Have one last try, and if you fail to find the treasure down below, I will feed you to my hungry crow. Uh -oh. The crow is flapping through the night. Everyone looks up in fright. They see him perch upon an oak and listen to his dreadful croak. Superworm is good to eat. Superworm's a special treat. He'll be juicy, fat, and firm. Hip, hip, hooray for Superworm. <gasps> Action quickly at the double. Superworm's in frightful trouble. We must help him if we can. We must hatch a cunning plan. <gasps> the toads and the snails and the bees and the beetles are worried about Superworm. The garden creatures leave their home, carrying a honeycomb. They jump and fly and crawl and creep. I wonder what their plan is. And find the lizard fast asleep. They chew the petals off his flower to rob him of his magic power. The caterpillars fetch some leaves while busily the spider weaves. The web is strong, the web is tough, the web is plenty big enough. The wizard wakes, 
This isn't funny. I'm wrapped in leaves and stuck with honey. Then up the bees and beetles fly and lift the web into the sky. This is the place and bang, crash, thrump. The wizard's in the rubbish dump. And now from somewhere underground, there comes a distant rumbling sound. The earth begins to heave and then, what do you think is going to happen? Superworm is back again. He came back from under the ground. Superworm, the swing, the slide, the hula hoop, the fairground ride. Superworm, the belt, the hat, the crane, the train, the acrobat. Then toads and beetles, bees and bugs, brother snails and sister slugs, uncle earwig, auntie ant, clap and cheer and chant this chant. Super worm is super long, super worm is super strong. Watch him wiggle, see him squirm, hip hip hooray for super worm. That's just kind of a funny story about a worm.